What's up guys and welcome back to my little super only shop here in Northern California. In today's episode, we're going to take a closer look at one of these Killer Bee oil pickups. They're definitely one of the highest quality aftermarket oil pickups on the market and replacing that factory oil pickup is a critical upgrade for any Subaru. Thank you so much for checking out the video guys. I'm Luke, this is the Subaru Only Show. This is my little Subaru Only Shop. It's a DIY Subaru channel. It's a channel where all I do is Subaru builds and race Subaru vehicles and motorsport events. It's a DIY themed channel where I walk you guys through the steps to get your Subarus back on the road and hopefully do a little racing of your own. So thanks for checking out the video guys. I really appreciate it. Okay, so let's start with why you want to replace that factory oil pickup. That's the pickup right here in my left hand. This is a factory oil pickup and there's definitely a recognized flaw with these pickups. If you take a closer look at one of these OEM oil pickups, you'll see that the welds on these pickups are actually brazed welds. And these brazed welds actually have a significant problem with failing on these engines. These brazed welds have been known to fail under certain conditions. And if these brazed welds fail for you, they're actually gonna allow air to be sucked up through this oil pickup. And that's gonna be like having a straw with a hole in it. Anytime you have a hole in that straw, you actually lose that suction signal and you can't suck up solid column of fluid. This is actually the orientation that this oil pickup is sitting when it's mounted in that engine and operating. And on the bottom here, this is actually where it sucks through. You can see as I rotate it up, there's actually a screen on the bottom of this pickup as well. So this pickup sits in your oil pan in this orientation, and the portion on the bottom right here is completely submerged in oil in that oil pan. So if one of these brazed welds cracks, this upper brazed weld is often above that oil level. And if this brazed weld fails up here in the upper portion, and you lose that vacuum signal, so you can't pull a solid column of oil through this lower portion where the screen is. So that's definitely the primary reason you need to replace this factory oil pickup. If this sucker fails, it's gonna prevent that lubrication system from getting oil to your engine bearings. And without that thin film of oil, those bearings are gonna heat up and they're gonna to seize to that crankshaft and you're gonna spin a bearing. Okay, so this is a Killer Bee pickup. Now, as you can see, the first thing that's different is that this pickup actually has three points of contact compared to that factory one, which I'm showing right here, only has two points of contact. So this Killer Bee pickup using three points of contact is actually a much more rigid way of connecting that oil pickup to the engine. And because you're connecting this pickup to the engine with three points, you're actually reducing a lot of those harmonics that are being transferred down to this pickup that probably lead to that brazed weld failure in the first place. In other words, if Subaru would have added a second leg to have three points of contact, like this Killer Bee design, they might have gotten away with those brazed welds and it may never have been a problem. But we'll never know because that's not the Subaru design. And Killer Bee didn't just stop with adding a second leg to have three points of contact. In addition to making it a much more rigid way of connecting to the bottom of that engine, Killer Bee is also using much thicker materials. These legs right here that create the bracket for this Killer Bee oil pickup are actually much, much thicker than the leg on this OEM pickup. And then the other thing you'll notice is actually the tube diameter. The tube that the Killer Bee pickup is using in my left hand is actually a much thicker tube and it might even have a slightly larger inner diameter. So that's the second major difference in design is they're using a thicker tube material and they might actually be using a little bit wider diameter for that tube. And then the third thing that's totally different about this Killer Bee pickup is that they're not using those brazed welds. These Killer Bee welds are all hand welded and you can see from the discoloration of the metal that all the welds have really, really good penetration. So these are definitely professional welds that are hand done by a welder that knows what he or she is doing. And the last thing that's a significant difference in the design of this Killer Bee oil pickup is actually the shape of that pickup. The factory pickup, which you can see right here, it's actually a round shape, it's completely flat, and it's got that mesh screen to strain out the oil. That's the factory design. This Killer Bee design, as you can see, actually has this triangular or pyramid shape. And the reason the Killer Bee is designed with that shape in it is actually pretty clever. When the pickup is installed in the engine, it's in this orientation. And the reason Killer Bee actually did that triangular shape on the bottom of that pickup instead of a flat shape is because if that oil pan were to get crushed up into the pickup, having that triangular shape actually prevents that oil pan that gets crushed up from completely sealing off that oil pickup. And that oil pickup can still actually function and can still draw in oil even though that oil pan has been completely crushed by hitting a rock or some other obstacle on the road. So that's actually the logic and the rationale for the design of this Killer Bee oil pickup. And I have to say, I think it's a really clever design and I'm stoked to be using it for my EJ205 engine build. 
Okay guys, I'm gonna wrap it up there for today. Thank you so much for joining me in my little Subaru only shop here in Northern California. In today's video, we talked about that factory oil pickup and where the fatal flaw is in the design of that pickup. And we compared it to the Killer B pickup, one of the aftermarket industry's leading solutions to a fatal flaw that's in that factory pickup. Thanks again for checking out the video, guys. If you like this video, please go ahead and give it a like. And if you have any comments, please go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section. Until next time, guys, I'm Luke. This is a super only show. Later!